Got the toilet pulled here in the doctor's office, and we'll take a look down line from here. There's the uh, toilet riser. It's cast iron. Got two inlets. Did you want to see this? We got two inlets coming in, one from the left, one from the right there. Otherwise, the pipe looks pretty good at this point. How deep is it so far? Well, it's only two feet deep. <laughs> he says he says it catches a ten. All right, so here we are. It's got a combination. It's turning to the left at six feet. There's an inlet coming in from the right. It looks like a small diameter. Looks pretty wide open. That's so good so far. Yeah, it looks very good. That means my office is clear. So we got water backed up there. See the water's piled up? Mm -hmm. So it may be a problem up ahead. There's, look at this tissue right there. Yeah, a little tissue, but you see how it goes uphill? Yeah. We're going to go under water here shortly. We don't run the water. Oh. Look at that. Yeah, that doesn't look good. What the heck is that? Well, I'm trying to want to. It's a hole in the bottom of dirt. No, no, I think it's just dirt. Surprising that it was there, though. See, this all this water is not good. Oh, no. Look at that. Well, it's just toilet paper. But I'm not going to. This could be a dip in the line. Yeah, he's probably up to mischief, huh? All right, so there goes the water. So why did the toilet paper wind up right there? Yeah. Back it up? Yeah, we're going to back it up. and It was at about between 35 and 40 feet. That's what so, you, actually, that's what you said last time. Oh, we're still holding water here. Look at this. I might have to get rid of this paper. It's pretty heavy duty. It's holding all that water back. See that? That's just paper holding that water back. Toilet paper? Yeah, toilet paper. Or, or paper towels. I don't know. Come in. All right, so there. Looks like it drops into a, a drop there, like it's going down into the main. Let's see if we can go find that. All right, let me go find that. at one more time on the way back. All right, so we're under the, uh, the back staircase, or we're just approaching it. This is where it drops in the wall right here. So now we're going to pull it back and see what's in that area that might be causing your repeat stoppages. Down, I would get it. Well, let's see. I mean, this looks pretty good here. We got minimal flow. 
Got a little piece of scale there. And it's a little bit flat here. It's holding water. And you can see the water line stays fairly high. Mm -hmm. So you might have a dip in the line that's holding water and paper cause and repeat blockages. Got a little bit of scale there. On the, see the, the pile on the left and right? Mm -hmm. That's uh, scale from cleaning. It gets scraped off the sides when they put a you going 50 feet right now? Yeah, we're 50 feet. And here's a turn. I think back here between 35 and 45 feet is where we saw that suspicious area. So we'll take a good look at that now. You see the scales flaking off the sides there? Mm -hmm. It might be you just need a good cleaning. Get all that scale out of there. Because every time a piece of that falls off, it grabs paper as it tries to flow down. And, uh, and then the paper accumulates and causes a blockage. The cockroaches just always hang out? Yeah, the cockroaches like to hang out down there. A little bit of flat spot here, it's holding a little bit of water. See, when, the, when, the, when it holds water like that, the paper tends to slow down, and then it stops, especially if it hits some scale. You see how, how much water we got here? Mm -hmm. And we go, we're going up into the lens. It's a two inch camera, so you got one inch of water there, almost. That's what it is, you gotta dip in the line. Not and so it's not draining good. Now it's up over the top of the lens. Don't flush the toilet, you think? Well, that won't help because it's just. Uh, see, so it starts right there and then it goes down and comes back up. See, now we're out of that water. Got to run a lot of water, a lot of flushing to get it to go through. You know what I mean? And wash it through. If you let it sit there, then it accumulates. Because I don't see anything wrong with the pipe. A little bit of scale, and that's about it. This pipe here looks good. So you got to dip in the line. You know, it could be that it's been there a long while, or maybe it's just starting. If it's just, just starting and, and the soil is, is sagging below, it may continue and get worse. Eventually, it'll just open up. So you might want to plan ahead to uh, have the pipe replaced or dug up in that area and leveled out.